Hi, fans. <laughs> Hey, so today on, no, hi, it's Liz. Welcome back to another video that I made. Uh, this is a video about videos. This is a video about giving you an opportunity to have some creative say in my videos. I have listed a bunch of ideas up on my Patreon and you are going to have to give me some money if you if you want to have a vote but i've got some good ideas so this is this is i'll tell you the ideas i'll tell you um one of them is i wanted to talk about hallucinations and what hallucinations are like both from my experience and you know i have a lot of friends who have various psychotic illnesses so i want to talk about that because there's a lot of misconceptions and uh, i was going to use a the movie a beautiful mind to frame how wrong those misconceptions are because that movie is just such terrible representation everybody loves it and uh no shade i used to love it so but it's not accurate at all um i also was thinking about i've been thinking about talking about this for a while and kind of afraid to but i wanted to talk about racism and mental health and how culpability fits in there because I think that's a question that I've never, people always answer with kind of platitudes or defensive sort of reductionist statements. But, um, you know, it's really a thing to have psychotic delusions and to have racism specifically creep into it, and especially anti-Semitism, which was specifically a thing for John Nash, like the, the guy that A Beautiful Mind is about his delusions were super anti-Semitic and they completely cut that out of the movie. So um, that's, that's an interesting topic, some interesting nuance we can get into. I also was thinking about talking about addiction and um, you know, why I hate the movie Requiem for a Dream as a representation of addiction, which it isn't actually supposed to be. I also, I had a, sort of a story time video I've been thinking about doing about the time when I was in kind of in the middle of a psychotic episode and I was falsely accused of theft. Um, I was framed by somebody. It's entertaining. I also have really for a while wanted to talk about my favorite movie for bipolar representation. And I'm not going to even, you're going to have to go to my Patreon if you want to see what it is such a good movie and nobody's seen it. And I've never seen a better portrayal of bipolar disorder and I've seen a lot of really bad portrayals. I probably get into that a little bit too and like why they're bad, why I think they're bad. Anyway, let me know what you want to hear about. Uh, I'm not going to pay attention to these comments. You got to go to Patreon and become a patron. Thanks.